here we are, are in San Stefano, Sunday the 27th of December 2015. It's about 10.30 in the morning. It's a lovely morning here after a few degrees of frost last night. And shortly we will start to mix the concrete, bring the concrete mixer up. Get the electricity in, connected and start to mix our concrete. So this is the uh, project for the container house. It's a 27 meter, 9 meters by 3 meter container. Uh, the concrete foundations are slightly larger at about 30 square meters. Uh, we've probably gone a little bit OTT uh, with the strength of the foundation for what's required, but prefer to do a belt and braces job. Uh, better to be safe than sorry. So. As you can see, the trenches uh, was all hand dog, marked out, and uh, we bought this um, waterproof uh, special membrane. Probably cost me about 50 euros to do the whole lot. Uh, the idea being that uh, damp won't rise uh, from the earth below, and because it's a metal uh, structure, the house itself, uh, just trying to prolong the life of it. It's supposed to last for about 50 years, but. The more protection you can give from the damp, obviously, the better. So, our uh, ring beams are in. Uh, we may have uh, spaced the rings a bit wider than uh, is recommended, but again, I think uh, we'll be okay. So, we will start uh, to lay uh, one row at a time to get to the, to the top of the, the, the ring beam. And then we'll uh, connect to these... Um, uh, inverted J's, I suppose, want of a better word. We'll put um, um, horizontal uh, rebar across the whole frame to join up in the middle and the other side. We'll then uh, fill with uh, backfill, rocks, whatever we have in rubble. We have lots of concrete rubble and stuff here. We have a pile of it. Uh, then we'll put the, um, um, what's the name for it? I've forgotten, the mesh. On the top of that, and we'll do a top fill to the to the level of the shottery, and uh, hopefully, sometime in January, uh, weather permitting, we'll have the house delivered, and uh, we'll move on to the next stage. Thank you for watching. Bye. So it's uh, Thursday, the 28th of January. We have a, a small window now, where it's going to be above freezing day and night. Uh, we don't know when it's going to get cold again, but we're okay for the next few days, so taking the opportunity to get uh, the concrete foundations in. You can see more or less the first row is in this morning. A uh, layer of uh, concrete, some uh, rocks thrown in the center, and then the uh, mesh placed on top and wired onto the uh, rebar that was in place. have a team of uh, workers today. Four strong lads uh, are hand mixing uh, the cement, or the concrete rather, because uh, they can do it in a bigger volume and quicker than uh, using our small mixer. So maybe we'll have a, another update later today. As you can see, there is still snow uh, lying about. We've, uh, we'll, we'll get it out with a small uh, hand uh, shovel, brush it out before we put the concrete on it, as we did with this one this morning. So there you are. There's your update. Over and out. <laughs>